Holden, Massachusetts police officer Jonathan Santamore said he was on the lookout for Richard Simone when he saw his pickup truck drive past him. Simone was wanted for felony level warrants, and Santamore says as he started to drive after him, things turned strange. Um, it was just so eerie, and I was preparing for the worst. And that's because he's driving so he's slow. He's driving so slow. Um, like I said, I, I figured if he was going to get away and wanted to get away and wasn't going to stop, he was going to hit the gas and he was going to go. Santa Moore was the first officer to start chasing Simone, a pursuit that often topped 100 miles per hour and lasted for more than an hour from western Massachusetts to Nashua, where it ended on a dead-end street. Massachusetts State Trooper Joseph Flynn is on trial for assault charges, accused of using excessive force during Simone's arrest an arrest that was captured by news helicopters. All of the police officers who have testified so far during this three-day trial say the entire event was dangerous and intense. You don't seem to be the type that's going to be afraid of a lot, but were you, were you apprehensive as you're in that pursuit? Yes. Nashua police officer Joshua Treffrey says he saw Trooper Andrew Monaco throw the first punch at Simone, but he couldn't make out much after that. You didn't see any uh, contact uh, beyond the swarm you've described uh, with respect to Joe, right? Correct. Monaco pleaded guilty to assault and is no longer working in law enforcement. He is expected to testify in this case. Reporting live in Nashua, I'm Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.